welcome back to another video hope you are okay on that side of the screen and if you have your usb drive with windows 10 installation windows 11 and probably another with linux and even though sometimes you have to figure out which is the usb drive that i will be erasing to put in another operating system that I want to install then this video is for you because today we are going to create a single USB drive that will carry all our operating systems and when we need Windows 10 11 Linux Android or even adding a new one will be really really easy that being said let's go to the screen I already have here our friend Google so let's search for Ventoy which is the name of the magic tool that will allow us to create this USB drive. Now there are some sections right over here that you might want to check out. I'm really appreciate to the developer so I also did a small donation which I do believe that it's important so that he can keep improving this great tool and probably we can check out the tested ISO which has a lot of operating systems. Some of them are curious that I want to test out as well but for this part of the video let's go to the downloads and we can select one of these versions let's select Windows and it will take us to the github page with the latest version available now let's download and in this particular case I want the Windows version and it did download um, normally right over here but here we had because I already made several downloads here got a error so let's just select keep this is totally okay it's used by the community and no issues whatsoever so I want to keep anyway and download this will also depending on the browser I'm using edge at this moment not really sure why but I am using on this machine on my desktop I already have a Ventoy right over here and I'm going to put in my USB drive on the computer and I'm going to open it up as you can see it's a 32 gigabyte uh, USB drive which is not that large but for this video will be more than enough so let's go to the Ventoy that we just downloaded and we will want to search to Ventoy to disk so just double click yes and it will give us this menu right over here please make sure that you are selecting the correct USB drive because we will erase completely the data that is there if you have then just press install and then make sure yes and it will ask us again are you sure yes I am and let's press it will install in a matter of a few seconds as you can see I will not even speed it up and there we go we are now ready to start on deploying some operating systems right over here in my case I've got some right over here on the desktop as you can see some Windows versions and then I have PFSense, Proxmox, Ubuntu. I'm just going to copy a few to my Ventoy USB drive. So for this example, I've copied PFSense and inside this folder, I've got two Windows uh, versions, 10 Lite and 11. Now the folder is just as an example so that we can see something on the bootable drive. At this moment, I could just remove the USB drive and put in on the machine that I want to install any operating system. But in my particular case for the video, I'll be using the machine that we are working right now so what I'm going to do is I'm going to restart and we are going to boot onto the BIOS now in your case might be delete F12 or F2 in my particular case it's delete so that we can reach the BIOS screen and here we are now as any other installation I just need to select the USB drive that I have in this particular case it's this one UFI USB partition 2 in your case it might have a different name but just select that and once we press the enter key boom these are the operating systems that I'm not really sure if I did show you or not PFSense Windows and Windows yes I did because we have Windows inside a folder but right over here we are not seeing that folder if we have have a lot of operating systems those folders in terms of organization will make sense and to be able to see them we will need to go right over here as you can see on F3 tree view I just need to press F3 and it will show me the Windows folder right over here so if I press Windows it will show me the Windows version and this might be very useful if you have a lot of operating systems and you want to find out quicker where they are in this particular case it's easy we can just go back we have the three operating systems here and if I press on Windows 11 it will ask me boot in normal mode yes boot in normal mode and there we go we are installing Windows 11 
not forgetting that inside the same USB drive I had Windows 10 and I also had PFSense, which are completely different operating systems on the same USB drive. And at this moment, I could keep on installing Windows without having to erase my USB drive. So hopefully this video was helpful in some way and if it was don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. Also a huge thumbs up for the team that developed Aventoy or the creator that developed Aventoy. My name is Roberto George and as always I'll see you guys on the next one.